Hi friends, welcome to AA Steam Series, and this is another experiment on surface tension. But in this video, I'll be showing you water, milk, oil, and vinegar. Are you excited? I made two other videos on surface tension, which will be given in the link in the description. Okay, now who's ready? So first, there is water right here, water right here. And then milk, oil, and vinegar. Okay, so first, let's take a dropper like this, squeeze it back, and then she gets sucked in. Okay, so now let's take some water, a lot of water. Yeah, it's full. Okay, now let's try just dropping it on the table. Right above here, and look. Splat. Splat, splat. Does it even have a shape? I don't think it does. See, it just splatters. So now, let's try keeping it on the coin. So, on the coin, drop it. Whoa! Look, it's almost a dome. Let's continue dropping. And there you go, a dome. Look, can you see there's a dome? So that'll take about 20 to 22 drops maximum. Well, if you have a $2 Canadian coin. And now for a quarter. So let me take some more water and a smaller coin. So it is a Canadian quarter. Should I put in water on it? So yeah, the same thing is happening. It's forming a dome. And it's forming. Yay! Good. And this will also take the exact same amount. 20 to 20 true drops. But guess what? It's smaller, so it will break more easily. So now let's empty this up. We're not using water anymore. We. Okay, no water left. Okay, now I'm gonna use 2% milk. So, I don't know, I've never tried it with 3% milk or 1% or even 0%. So, I don't know. So first, milk, drop. Whoa, okay, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Whoa. Please stay. Please stay. They all want to see it. So, yeah. Keep going. What? It's actually staying. Now let's empty this up. So, yeah, that got pretty dirty in the milk. So, it's better to have a second dropper. Ta da! Yeah, it will look very different. Okay, the next one is vegetable oil. You can try olive oil too, and extra virgin olive oil. But I'm using vegetable oil. Right. Put it inside the dropper. I don't think anyone died. No, it did. Okay, so now try the oil. Whoa. That looks so shiny now. Can you believe it? It's even working for oil. Well, probably a couple more. And stop. Yeah, I'm gonna scare that out great. So I don't want the dome to fall. But you must be wondering how this is staying. Let's do vinegar. So, suck it in. In. I'm good. And vinegar! Vinegar, vinegar, yay! Can't believe it. Actually working, yeah. Yes! Oh no. No, we need more vinegar. Vinegar, 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 vinegar. 
Okay, so let's squeeze it out. So now let's move these away. Can you see how nicely the dome can form? Works for water, milk, and water again, oil, and vinegar. And guess what? They all have something in common. Yes, they're all liquids. Yes, water's a liquid, milk's a liquid, water, why don't you say water again? Oil and vinegar. Now how cool is that? But now let's compare. Remember the drop that you put right here? Yeah, it just spreads. And now look, it's still spreading. It's getting wider and flatter. Now look at this. It's a dome and it's not spreading anymore. It's just within the coin because it has an edge and I'm going to tell you the science behind it. So it's not just because it's the edge. It's because of surface tension. Yes, like I told you in the beginning of the video. This video is on surface tension. So yes, surface tension. So now there's lots of different kinds where surface tension can happen. This one is that the water is a polar molecule, which means it has a positive end and a negative end. So, well, it's like a magnet. Magnets also have positive and negative ends. So when they touch each other, they're stuck. You have to pull them apart. They won't come apart unless you pull. So the same thing is happening here. It's like a magnet. So it's attached together, stuck. And then, when it's stuck, it remains as a dome. So it keeps forming and forming and forming until gravity overcomes the dome. So, poof. It'll just break and then it'll spill everywhere. But then, that's just gravity. What can you do? Get anti-gravitized anything. So yeah, now wasn't it pretty cool? Can you think of any other liquids that you could try? So I got water, milk, oil, and vinegar. Can you think of anything else? So yeah, you can keep on experimenting. And wasn't that fun? Now I changed my mind. So I thought, why not you guys see how I'm gonna break the surface tension? So let me get some more water. Breaking surface tension. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. So, more. Yes, we're almost about to break surface tension. Yes. Yes. Woohoo! Can you see it? It's off the coin, and now, yeah, can you see it? Look. Yeah, I don't know, it's sort of getting wet, and now it's all over the place. Now let's break this one. And, there we go. So now, this is a really fun game. Now, I just use quarters and a toonie. Toonie means two dollar coin. So, quarter and two. So, now, have I tried a penny? What about a dime? A nickel? Well, do you want to try them? Yeah, it's a fun game to play. So you can see how many drops they'll each take. So that took more than 22. That definitely took more than 22. So yeah, now you can try the milk, oil, and vinegar. How fun was that? Yeah, super duper fun. So yeah, I guess that's it. I showed you this, hope you enjoyed, and had fun. Show this to your friends, it's a really cool game. So, until then, see you later, stay safe, stay tuned. Till then, bye bye